Hello and welcome once again to the Rugged Rock Hound. It's Tuesday. So yesterday we were up on top of the hill, that awesome spot that Eric found, and got all those really cool barite crystals. So that was a neat pocket, but in a po in a nodule that size, I can't imagine there being only one little pocket of barite. There's probably more. So let's keep digging at it. Let's see if we can find any more today. Back at the hole and it looks just like the way I left it. So the barite pocket was right there. So, don't want to dig anywhere in here, probably. I want to keep my search in this area. So I'm going to try over there, over that way, and down. Wish me luck. I just moved this big rock, this whole thing, and right behind it, there was this small pocket of barite. So each of these little pieces you see, these are all barite. It's all broken. But I did pull this one out, which looked kind of nice. Nice and clear. Got one crystal right there. And that's the rock I pulled out. So I'm going to inspect that more closely to see if there's any barite on it. I don't know. There's a lot of calcite, but maybe some barite as well. So a bunch of broken pieces. It looks like it's mostly a vein, but I did get this out. Look at that. Nice terminated crystal of barite. Might be more. And that's pretty much it for that pocket. It was just a small one right here. Mostly just broken pieces, but there were a few terminated crystals. So, still neat. There's nice little pockets here and there. Even though that was just a small one, you know, <laughs> who knows how many more pockets there are. And who knows when we'll hit a big one. So, yeah, you just keep going. Just move these rocks off the floor. And I don't see a pocket there, but when I move this rock, look. There's a cool little barite crystal in there. That's neat. Finally decided to take a moment and look more closely at that rock I had pulled out that I was like, I need to check it and see if there's barite. So it's a vein of barite. You've got a crystal there. This one right here that's all fractured that was broken there. This is barite. You can see the darker color. So this is just a nice big vein of barite. Unfortunately, not much in the way of terminated crystals, at least not exposed. And then a little bit more down here. So interesting. I'll have to think about whether I'm going to take it back or not. Maybe. So I've been pulling up the rocks here, and I haven't seen, like, any barite. And as I was pulling this out right here, I thought it was just another rock until... Looked at it a little more closer. Look at that. It's a crystal of calcite. Nice. What they call dragon's tooth. Wow, that's a pretty big one. That's, that's pretty neat. Definitely taking that back. There might be more in here. After digging that way and that way quite a lot, I really didn't run anything else. So, not a lot for today. But we're going to call it there because the sun's getting low and time to head back. So, well, some days you just, that's, that's all you get, you know. Maybe tomorrow or whatever day I come out next, probably tomorrow. Hopefully a better day. Hello, and welcome once again to the Rugged Rock Hound. I'm back at the Bearite. And I'm gonna back, go back up to the hill where Eric found that one pocket where I pulled out that good barite the other time. I think there's still more up there. And it's been a little while, it's been about a week and a half, so I wonder if anybody else has gone up there and dug. Guess I'll go and find out. That's okay if somebody else did, I don't care. <laughs> but I wanna go look in the pocket and just keep digging to see if there is more barite in there, cause why not? Let's get up there. Here's the hole in all its glory. And it looks just the way I left it. Nobody else has been out here yet. Okay. Let's get cracking. Actually, somebody has been here. Somebody dug this side right here. I didn't do this. Look at all that calcite. They were following the calcite. But from what I can see, I don't think they found any barite. It's probably just calcite. Oh well, happens to everybody. Just thought I'd show you this piece. It's got some interesting little calcite sprays on it you can see some yeah some crystals a little few little bladed calcite crystals a few right there which is kind of cool so i just kind of wanted to point out so that good pocket that i found was right about here where my fist is and then i found that that's a small pocket over here which didn't really have hardly any crystals in it it was just a vein mostly so that's the only really good pocket i've found so far i've dug all of that so I'm not entirely sure where to go, but I figure 
it was here. So I'm going to keep searching here. So I'm going to try and go down. I've been digging a while finding lots of calcite. But my thought is this. So I found the one pocket there, but it was past the calcite. The calcite stopped and then there's barrett. And the same thing with the little pocket over there. So I'm thinking maybe this side over here, going that way, that has all this calcite here still. If I just remove all that, maybe there's barite behind it. I decided to film the end a little different. Instead, I just took everything out here and I just placed it down to kind of slowly go over it with the macro lens and look at everything. Because there was just a lot of broken pieces. Pretty, some of them very clear, but very few actual complete crystals, mostly just pieces. So I thought I'd show you just all the cool broken pieces. Yeah, a lot of pretty cool pieces. That is mostly what I got from the day. Go kind of back over it slowly. Can add them. Lots of broken pieces of barite. Lots of them very clear. Still quite neat. And I'm back home. So actually it's been like over a month since I was out there. I just haven't gotten around to finishing up this video. <laughs> just, some things get away from me a little bit, but it was a lot of fun. This might be the last time going out to barite for quite some time. It's hot, it's summer, and I've already got a lot of stuff out there. And you guys now know the area pretty well. Anyway, Next time, who knows where we'll be. And until next time, remember, there is treasure everywhere.